Welcome back. Um, that was a little bit of an article about this this procedure, which enables people to who are may may not be ready to have children yet, or for whatever reason um, want to have the ability, possibly in the future, to have children. A little procedure of freezing the eggs um, and using them later, mm -hmm. I guess, is the quite simple form of this. Mm, yeah. um, there's a, actually a very good chance of success these days, and it's becoming a lot more popular to be doing this. Although a little bit on the expensive side for some people, there are some places that actually offer help for this um, and maybe some support. So these people who want to freeze their eggs uh, can actually do that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's a great service mm -hmm. and hopefully will be increasingly funded by uh, healthcare services yeah. around the world. Yeah, it's, it's catching on in Korea too. Um, and so I think this is a sort of good compromise between the pressures that some may have to have children from uh, their parents or other uh, older generation typically. Mm -hmm and the ability to choose when to have a child. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it definitely helps. Mm -hmm. um, I've actually got a couple of friends who have oh. frozen their eggs and well, then. even successfully gone on to have children using those frozen eggs. I guess they think it's probably a good idea then, but mm -hmm. pray tell. Well, uh, in one case, it was more of a, um, a medical issue. Uh, she had to freeze the eggs oh. um, because she <sighs> was potentially going through early menopause. So uh, this provided just her to have that security that just in case she wanted to have children mm -hmm. in the future. And as it turned out, she did want to have mm -hmm. children in the future. And so she was very glad that she had frozen her eggs. Wonderful. And mm -hmm. in another case, it was uh, a fertility issue. So it was connected to the IVF treatment, uh, which mm -hmm. helps couples who struggle to conceive. Um, so I guess this is not a freezing of an egg, but a freezing of an embryo. Um, which uh, then could later be uh, implanted into the womb uh, and successfully grew into a beautiful young child as well. So That is just, it's so insane to think about this mm -hmm. technology and to tell your child, you know you were frozen when you were <laughs> Yeah, wow, how cool You started off as an ice cube, you realize <laughs> that, right? <laughs> Uh, obviously, it's more complicated than being an ice cube, but mm -hmm. yeah. that is wonderful stories, actually. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. I've known there's a lot of couples around me and uh, you know who I know of that have used different methods for um, pregnancy or just to have a child, mm -hmm. and it's it's been quite nice. I mean, there's definitely getting better technology, so you know the chance of miscarriage is dropping mm -hmm. a lot, which is quite nice. Um, but yeah, it's 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 getting. Getting good. I heard that uh, not for this freezing, but for, ooh, I don't know the procedure name, but there is a procedure of implanting the embryo directly into the uterus, and that can cause uh, twins to be born at a higher rate than mm. normal. Yes, mm -hmm. it's IVF. It's in vitro fertilization. Mm -hmm. You already said it, yeah. and I did not know it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. um, so, though that can perhaps be an unexpected surprise. In most cases, perhaps a welcome one. Yes. Yeah. Two for the price of one. And I would love to have an identical twin. You know how much fun we would have in life? That would be so cool. Yeah. yeah. And I'd be my own best friend. Mm -hmm. We'd both be in Korea and I would just go to work half the time. He'd go to work half the time. <laughs> but you'd have to live on one paycheck. He would have a different job. <laughs> and so we would be able to switch up jobs if we got bored. I see. It just before the funsies of changing. Yeah, exactly. Two jobs. Did they have any like medical difficulties through this? From remembering what my uh, my friends have been through, it doesn't necessarily lower your chance of miscarriage if you go through the IVF procedure. Ah, okay. Um, in okay. fact, uh, it can perhaps raise it a little bit, uh, just because there, uh, it's not quite as simple to get the embryo attached to the wall, womb wall as it is with natural fertilization. Mm. Um, but again, I think, you know, as time goes on, as uh, technologies mm. uh, progress, um, I'm sure that the rates of miscarriage will come down even with that. So. Let's go ahead and take a look at that vocabulary below and we'll see you in the next unit. Fertility. Fertility. Miscarriage. Miscarriage. Materialize. Materialize. Run. 
Run. Ambiguity. Ambiguity.